QXG7 Plus. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed Black in that one. The opening was balanced. White was a cut above Black in the middle game. Opening with the Queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. c4 builds a strong center by controlling the important d5 square and creates a square for the knight to come to c3 without blocking the c-pawn. E6 opens up a line for the dark squared bishop and prepares to castle quickly, while preparing to push a pawn to d5 and recapture with a pawn if captured. The Catalan opening is a slower, more positional opening where white prepares to fianchetto the light squared bishop on g2, where it will help control the center. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This blocks the check from an opposing bishop. This defends a bishop that was under attack and had no defenders. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. This prepares the bishop for development. Castling develops a rook while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is the last book move. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This strikes at the center with a pawn, fighting for space. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is excellent. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is good. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is excellent. Right on target. It is best. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. This moves the bishop to safety. It is excellent. This is a fair move. It is good. That's fine. It is good. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. The game is still close to equal, but white lost their advantage. It is an inaccuracy. This misses an opportunity to develop a knight off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. It is excellent. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. Very precise. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. This threatens to reveal an attack on a queen. It is best. This develops a queen off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. White had an advantage, but now the game is close to equal. It is a mistake. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. This is the only move that works. This threatens to reveal an attack on a queen. It is a great move. This exposes an attack, threatening a pawn. It is good. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable pawn. It is best. This activates a rook by getting it to the 7th rank and also restricts the opponent's king. It is good. 
This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This defends the attacked bishop. It is excellent. This protects the attacked rook. It is good. This kicks an opposing queen. It is best. The rook is now adequately defended. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. It is a mistake. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This overlooks an opportunity to block a check from the opposing queen. It is a miss. Right on target. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. It is good. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This ignores an opportunity to double rooks on a single file. It is a mistake. This is an equal trade. It is best. This leads to losing a bishop. It is a blunder. This is the way to win a bishop. It is good. A very strong play. It is excellent. That bishop was free for the taking. It is best. This move puts the pawn on a safer square. This threatens to play checkmate. It is best. This is the only good move. This prevents the opponent from being able to play checkmate. It is a great move. A solid choice. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is excellent. This evades the check from the queen. It is best. This threatens to play checkmate. It is good. This wins material. This stops the opponent from being able to play checkmate. This is the start of the end game and white is winning. It is best. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. That was a truly amazing move. This is the only move that works. It is brilliant. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. The opening was balanced. White was a cut above black in the middle game.